Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez's New York district, long a bastion of progressive ideals, showed a notable shift toward Donald Trump in the 2024 election. While Trump's opponent, Kamala Harris, still carried the district, the Democratic margin was cut to 64.8 percent, down significantly from Biden's 77.2 percent in 2020. Trump gained 33.4 percent of the vote, a remarkable increase for a GOP candidate in this far-left stronghold. The left may have underestimated the changing priorities of New Yorkers. In an environment where crime rates are climbing and unchecked immigration policies are leading to public safety concerns, many in AOC's district appear to be embracing policies centered on security and economic stability. The recent arrest of an illegal migrant for a homicide in AOC's district has only heightened anxieties over border security. This shift is echoed throughout New York City, where the Democratic vote has softened across the board. Harris won only 55.8 percent of New York's total vote, compared to Biden's 60.9 percent in 2020. If Democrats continue ignoring calls for stronger borders and safer communities, they may soon lose even their deepest blue districts. November's election was a wake-up call. Many Americans want security, economic growth, and stable communities, not the radical policies the far-left champions. The question now is, will AOC and her allies listen?